So NASA working to send humans back to the moon while other nations making major efforts of their own. So more than half a century after the U.S. beat Russia to the moon, Russia and India in a race to land unmanned spacecraft near the lunar South Pole this, uh, this month. China plans to send astronauts by 2030. Ice discovered in the region could be used for life support or rocket fuel for future Mars missions wild. Legal experts say the race for resources presents new challenges to a 56-year-old treaty that sets guidelines for international space exploration. A state like China or the United States cannot claim property on the moon, cannot claim territory on the moon. But what does that mean for commercial enterprises? And what does it mean when you want to go to the moon for a specific reason, like getting access to the water ice? Experts warn China's ambitions could lead to potential conflicts on the moon, but they also point out how cooperation between the U.S. and Russia led to construction of the International Space Station.